Most of us fortunately can stay inside when the heat is like this. But what about people who have to work outside? How dangerous is prolonged heat? WGNO's Jordan Lippincott has more on drinking water. Jordan. Susie Kurt, that heat warning that he, Hank mentioned is still in effect for another hour. And if you all were out here at the Bonneville boat launch here in Metairie, you all would feel why. Earlier today, I checked in with the staff at Pelican Point Car Wash in Metairie when it was even hotter. The staff says they rotate employees working inside and outside, along with taking advantage of ice cold rags and drinking plenty of water. But can someone drink too much water? We asked Dr. Jordan Harry about the chances of water toxicity or overhydration. So it, it definitely can happen. I mean, we all need water to live, um, but if you drink too much water too quickly, you know, we, we think of kind of in the two liters or per an hour range, your kidneys can't keep up. That's why Harry recommends drinks with electrolytes or electrolyte tablets to maintain the body's natural levels of potassium and sodium. But for those who don't like drinking water, this isn't a get out of jail free card. Drinking water will always be essential, but if you're working outside or breaking a sweat, try to get those electrolytes in. Susie. All right. Thanks, Jordan.